Hey, what's up Geeks? Ian here for Pinoy Metric channel and thank you very much for joining me for another video. We're here to talk about a very popular laptop from Huawei. It was released April of last year and it has aged well and it's still actually one of the best laptops that you can buy in the market right now. So I'm talking about none other than the Huawei MateBook T15. 2022. In this video, we'll talk about the features that makes the laptop a standout even in the year 2023. So before we get into the list of the features, I'd like to thank you all geeks for actually been with us since the start. And if you're new to the channel, please give us some love by smashing that subscribe button or hitting the thumbs up for this video. So without further ado, let's dive in. Let's go. So again, this is the Huawei MateBook D15 and by its moniker, you would know that this is a 15-inch laptop. And by laptop standards, this is big enough to accommodate all the tasks that we're doing with a computing machine. And this is not just a laptop with big screen. Its display is optimized to be used with multiple apps running side by side. For example, you're working with a document through a Microsoft Word on the side and then you are opening a browser for cross-referencing on the left side, which is technically my working setup, by the way. Another thing is the three-sided trimmed-down bezel, which is very slim. It actually makes the display even more expansive. I also love the fact that the panel has a tough Rainland low blue light and flicker-free certification. So you know me, when I'm not on my phone, I'm in front of my laptop. So this feature is really a great help in keeping my eyes fresh and sharp all day long. The number two feature of the MateBook D15 that I'm thrilled to have even up to this day is its design. For a minimalist guy like me, this piece of tech is like a luxury item. I always carry this around when I'm in a coffee shop or I'm in a library. Also, I travel a lot, so aside from the clean aesthetics, the MateBook D15 only weighs 1.6 kilograms. So I always slide it in my bag whenever I go. So technically, I don't have to have a separate bag for the laptop. I can just slide it in my travel bag and that's very convenient to have especially when I'm traveling with lighter baggage. Of course, it has a very generous set of ports. Um, it has one USB port, one HDMI port in case you need to hook it up for an external monitor, two USB-A 2.0 ports, one USB 3.2 Gen 1 port, and get this, it has a headphone jack. And did I also mention that you can hide the actual camera of the laptop? This is something I use very often when I'm in a conference call and I don't want to show my face in the camera view. So I physically shut the camera down and whenever I accidentally press the camera function in my conference app, I'm still quite sure that I won't be registered in the camera because it's physically recessed. Okay, before we continue, how about you guys? Comment down below your favorite feature in a laptop or what tasks do you do mostly with your laptop? I'm quite interested to know. Okay, the third one is the processing power. The MateBook T15 may be a light laptop, but that does not take away its capability in efficiently handling tasks. On paper, my laptop is powered by 11th gen Intel Core i5 processor and Intel Iris Xe graphics. So I really appreciate the fact that I'm not spending much time in loading apps. And even if I multitask, I'm not experiencing app crashes. And of course, I would also like to mention that even if it's a powerful device, it's still a very quiet laptop. I'm really not sure how Huawei aced this part, but I think it has something to do with the 0.2mm Huawei Shark Fin Fan technology. I also do gaming with the Huawei MateBook D15. My favorite card graphic game, The Legends of Runeterra, runs very well with the MateBook D15. It's very engaging on a large screen and if situated properly on a desk, the hit buildup is quite manageable. Of course, I love streaming shows in Netflix or Disney+. Plus. So with the MateBook D15's large screen and capable speakers, this is my go-to entertainment device, especially when I'm on the go or when I'm not in my home office. So up next is the laptop's Wi-Fi 6 capability. Wi-Fi 6 has been a very essential innovation in the past few years, and it will definitely continue to dominate this 2023. Good thing the Huawei MateBook D15 has a Wi-Fi 6 technology. When connected with a Wi-Fi 6 router, I take advantage of a wider coverage, stronger signal, and faster Wi-Fi speed even if I have several devices connected on my network. In turn, I don't have to worry about slow internet. It's really a great thing that Huawei future-proof this device with Wi-Fi 6. For the number 5 feature, or I guess, Features tied in the number 5 position are the software and battery. 
As for the software, the MateBook D15 boots with Windows 11 Home. One thing I like owning multiple Huawei devices is their seamless inter-device connectivity. The Huawei MateBook's D15 drag-and-drop multi-screen collaboration has been very useful since I use a Huawei phone in taking photos and videos. You can also open at most free phone apps in your laptop for better multitasking or even access your phone's files from your laptop. On top of that, you can seamlessly transfer calls from your phone to your laptop. Battery-wise, the Huawei MateBook D15 2022 is packed with 56-watt-hour battery capability. This could last a considerable amount of time away from the wall outlet. In my own experience, I last 5-6 to six hours in a working day. Charging it from 0 to 100% would only take me roughly 1.5 hours due to the 60-watt supercharged support. Well, if you're thinking of getting a Huawei MateBook D15 2022 laptop, this could be the best chance to have one. Huawei is having a New Year sale wherein you can get up to 6,000 peso off of Huawei devices and up to 13,998 peso worth of freebies. For example, the 8GB 512GB variant of the Huawei MateBook D15 is only priced at 37,999. It's down from its original price of 39,999. If you're interested, you can always check out Huawei online stores or their brick and mortar stores near you. Okay, to wrap everything up, I'm telling you this, guys. The Huawei MateBook D15 2022 with 11th Gen Intel Core processor is still one of the most best value laptops to date. I mean, at this year of 2023, it's still one of the best laptops that you can buy right now with its stunning display, simple yet minimalist design, Wi-Fi 6 connectivity, and 11th Gen Intel Core processor. This device is still worth considering this 2023. So I guess that's all for me, Geeks. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.